Welcome to lecture number 42 of the series Unreal 5 for Arquis and in this lecture we'll learn how we can migrate all of our assets, files and folders into a new project. So let's get started. I'm aware that in this lecture we were supposed to start working on blueprints to create a real-time interactive walkthrough. But I think this is the perfect time to migrate all of our assets into a new project. Okay, so before working on blueprints, we're going to migrate all of our assets. Okay. So the big question is that why do we need to migrate all of our assets into a new project? The problem with this project is that we downloaded different materials from Megascans library and then we use those materials for these static meshes. Okay. We downloaded a lot of materials and then we interchange between those materials to see which material looks best for that particular static mesh in our scene. And because of that, there are a lot of unused textures and materials in our project. So for that purpose, we will migrate this level into a new project. Okay. When we'll migrate this level into a new project, all of our assets, materials and textures will go with it which will leave behind all of those unused materials and textures. Okay. So first of all, what we need to do is we need to create a new project. So first of all, I'll open Unreal Engine. I'll go into architecture and I'll select this blank project. Let's find a folder to save this project. I'll create a new folder and I'll rename this folder as pool house. Let's select this folder. pool underscore house underscore project okay yeah let's go back into the previous project now I'll migrate this level and it will take all of my files and folders and assets that are associated or made in this level okay I'll open this level I'll go into asset actions and I'll click on migrate it will select all of my static meshes, geometry cache, materials, textures that are associated or made in this level. Okay. Make sure everything is checked. Don't uncheck anything. I'll click OK. Now I'll open the content folder of the new project. I'll go into this pool house folder. I'll open this content folder and I'll select this folder. Okay. Let's now open the pool house project. Yeah. I'll go into levels and I'll open this level. Okay. Now I'll go into my content folder and I'll select these files and I'll delete them. Okay, so yes, that's it. All of our assets, folders, files, collisions, everything associated with that level is now into our new project. Okay, let's now go into the Windows File Explorer and compare the file sizes. Okay, so this is the Windows File Explorer. This is the pool house project. And this is the project from which we migrated all of our files. Okay, let's go into the properties. And as you can see that the size of this project is 19.4 gigabytes. Okay, let's now compare this file size with the pool house project. I'll go into the properties and as you can see that the size of this project is now 3.23 gigabytes. Okay. So it's a massive improvement. So yes, that's it for this lecture. And in the next lecture, we'll start working on our blueprints to create real time interactive walkthrough. Okay. So yes, I'll see you guys in the next one.